Welcome to Fluid Management Technologies video on how to set up user data on the SmartFill Gen 2 website. If you need to have your drivers enter more than a simple job number when dispensing fuel, then you will need to enable user data entry. This is useful when your company has multiple routes labelled as 1, 2 and 3 and fuel needs to be monitored. Routes being our example of a specific data set that also needs to be documented during a fill. To enable user data, do one of the following. 1. If you want the data to be attributed to a vehicle, then go to the Vehicles page and tick the checkbox for Enable User Data on the Transaction Inputs page next to each vehicle that you want to have this data for. 2. If you want the data to be attributed to a driver, then go to the Drivers page and tick the checkbox for Enable User Data on the Transaction Inputs page next to each driver that you want to have this data for. User data can be used in one of two ways. 1. You can enter the data required with a corresponding numerical code to be handed to your drivers. Or 2. Not have any user data in the list at all and allow free form entry by your drivers. They will still be required to enter something, but it will not be checked in any way. This can be useful when there are many sets of data that change on a daily, weekly or monthly basis. To set up user data, Go to the User Data page from the top menu. The first item on the left menu allows you to make the user data name more fitting for the purpose you have in mind for it. This name will be the column header on the transaction report and also on the top menu. The Definitions menu will show you what data has already been created and allow you to add more data to the list. To add more data, just click the Add button and add a numerical code and a description of the data. Remember. If you want to allow free form entry, then this list has to be empty. If you have more than one SmartField Gen 2 unit allocated to your website, then the Unit Allocation menu allows you to specify which SmartField unit the user data pertains to. Thank you for joining us for this short video on how to set up user data on the SmartField Gen 2 website.